I want to talk to you guys about leash aggression or leash reactivity I should say either way they're both kind of the same thing your dogs reactive if he's aggressive he's reactive but just because he's reactive doesn't mean he's aggressive so let's talk about leash re aggressive leash reactivity for a second so your dog is on leash if he decides to be barking at people or dogs it is because he does not want to be around them okay if your dog barks lunges bites people on walks your dog needs a break from people on walks period give your dog a break if your dog is reactive to dogs on leash then you want to keep dogs away from him for a while uh, while he's on leash when a dog is on leash you're taking their ability away to flight so what do they have to do they have to resort to conflict to fight in order to get their, that unwanted pressure away from them whether it be uh, people or dogs or bikers or whatever or cars some dogs are even reactive to cars so uh, leash aggression you will have to uh, make sure you give your dog a job to do on the walk in order to get over his insecurity he needs something to do to occupy his mind he can't piss everywhere he can't shit anywhere he can't sniff everywhere he's got to have a job to do he's got to be able to focus so uh, making him heal by your side with a loose leash is how you get that okay so I have a video on how to do that I'll, I'll put a link in the description um, and so you can go straight to the how to walk okay and it details what equipment to use and again the technique that needs to be used in order to get your dog to walk loose leash beside you because it starts with your leadership on one hand you have to control the environment and on the other hand you have to uh, control your dog okay I mean point blank period 90% of people do not know how to use the leash the leash is not to keep your dog from running from you that's not what it's for yes it is used that way but the leash is actually a tool that you can use to get your dog to behave well off leash off leash that's the goal for any dog any every dog should be trained on how to behave off leash and how you get there is um, that heel with a loose leash like I was talking about before okay yeah breathe here a little bit okay hope you guys can hear me um, so yeah loose leash use the leash as a tool not just a apparatus to keep your dog from running from you okay that's like what they used to do to slaves and shit so you don't want to do that all right so that's about that's about it on leash aggression um, once again you got to be the dog's advocate don't let the dog advocate for itself you got to if you've got to uh, you always want to be as gentle as possible with any of these tools but uh, the tools that I use you can certainly need, can be firm as firm as necessary in order to achieve what you want to achieve so check out that how-to video and uh, comment below don't forget to like subscribe and uh, make sure you guys let me know if you want more of these videos because I I think this will be a pretty good uh, pretty good playlist to put together so that's leash aggression all right see you later